and this is just a short video I've made uh, trying to show you the difference between the analysis charts and prognosis weather charts that we get on ships through the radio facsimile and what is the difference and what are the different ways or forms of these uh, charts that I wanted to show you. So on your left side that you see is an analysis chart and the right side is the prognosis chart. So I'll tell you the difference between each and how they are uh, represented sometimes. So uh, analysis charts are also known as the mean sea level analysis charts or MSL analysis uh, where the pressures are provided in hectapascals as you see on the bottom left hand corner. Uh, the pressures are indicated and these charts are basically um, uh, indicating the weather that exists at a particular point of time. So it exists, it, it shows the current weather patterns. Um, and uh, the weather patterns are shown in the form of isobars um, that are lines joining places of equal pressure that you see on your charts and uh, surface winds, frontal systems, low and high pressure positions where L uh, stands for low pressure and H stands for high pressure and the pressures are denoted right below the letters. You also have the cold fronts, uh, which are the blue lines with the triangles on them in the direction in which the cold front is moving. And then you also have the troughs denoted by the dotted line or the dashed line rather. So these are sea level analysis charts uh, gives a mirror the indication of the weather at a current scenario. And these charts are issued at every six hours, 12 hours, 18 hours or 24 hours uh, period. Sometimes if uh, if there is a tropical revolving storm or a depression nearby, which may affect the uh, ship's passage severely, they are issued at even uh, lesser intervals. But more normally, they start from at midnight and they are issued at every six hourly interval. So these are the mean sea level analysis charts, uh, which indicate weather um, at the current position or particular position of time. All right. Uh, prognosis charts, on the other hand, are charts that provide an indication of future weather patterns and they provide the outlook to the mariner for the next 24 hours or 48 hours or more. So they provide you with a prediction of the weather and these are used by mariners to get an idea or indication of what the weather is going to be like in the future. So the analysis charts provides a current weather scenario and the prognosis charts provide a, a future weather scenario. So for planning so as you can see here, this is a prognosis chart uh, that is mentioned uh, right below the bottom of the chart. Again, the pressures are denoted. It, this, they're very similar to the analysis charts, but uh, they provide a future scenario. All right. And they have a validity period, of course. Uh, this doesn't hold good. So till the next prognosis chart is issued, this prognosis chart has a validity period. Uh, some some of these prognosis charts are issued in this format here that you see on your screens. They are the four day prognostic charts. So not only 24 hours and 48 hours, sometimes they provide you with a four day prognosis chart as well. And uh, these are very useful, especially like I said before, if there are any tropical revolving storms or any depressions or any frontal depressions or any storms nearby, uh, gives an indication of uh, the weather that would be there and it's a good idea to get an indication of four days in the future especially there is a, uh, um, a, a tropical storm around uh, again uh, they have a validity period and uh, they will be updated after at every time a prognosis chart is issued and although it's just an indication and uh, this indication or this uh, prognosis is based on uh, historical study of the weather patterns in the past uh, so of course uh, they although they cannot be claimed to be absolutely accurate, but uh, since they base it on historical analysis, uh, the mariners can somewhat rely on this to get an indication of what the weather is going to be. All right, so as this chart here uh, is shows you the, uh, it's very similar to the analysis charts in terms of presentations where you have the isobars, the low pressure, the high pressure, the cold fronts, the troughs, uh, and the symbols of each are divide, uh, even uh, sometimes defined as you see on the bottom or on the top of the chart. Uh, so like I said, uh, these are the four day prognostic chart and they are very useful in terms of weather routing and planning. So I thought I'll just uh, make this quick short video on the difference between analysis charts and prognosis charts so that uh, you get an idea of uh, what the difference between each are and why they are used on the ships. Um, so let me know what you thought about this video and I'll make a, a another video on weather maps very soon. I'll see you soon guys. Uh, keep studying hard.
Bye.